In 2011, for the first time since such data began to be collected, non-white births in the United States outnumbered white ones. This is a significant event, but it is my opinion that most Americans see it as a milestone as opposed to a fork in the road. And I say Americans both white and non-white. There are many reasons for this, far more than one could actually get into in a short YouTube video. But the most important one, if you ask me, is a particular and perhaps unique American approach to the phenomenon of multiculturalism. Most Americans are not hostile to living in a multi-ethnic society. In fact, most Americans, I think, take it for granted that they do live in an incredibly diverse society, and that's simply fundamental to the nature of American society. However, I believe that almost all Americans either subscribe to or are not decisively hostile to something that could be described as an American value set, an American lifestyle, an American mindset. And if anything, this American way of thinking, way of seeing the world, is becoming more and more prevalent in American society as the society develops. Perhaps in overt terms of skin pigmentation, the United States is changing. But a reverse process of assimilation is actually taking place to a much greater extent that is drawing uh, the non-white American elements of American society into itself in much the same way as the original British elements of American society drew the Italian, Irish, German, Russian, and Jewish and other European uh, elements into itself. It's a fascinating process and I don't think it's going to be without bumps, without major bumps, but I do believe it's both inexorable and inevitable.